Yo, that is the biggest bass I've ever caught in my life. I've never caught one that big either. The biggest, spawning. The biggest bass I've ever caught is probably. It lands on. Holy. Crappie son. That's a crappie. Oh my god. Everything doing that. You're holding the line tight. There's no drag can let him on anything. You literally swap the switch. Why, why was I don't understand why you're having oh, back here. Last week we, were, we did not record. We we're just out here not recording. And Jake, what's the feeling being back this week? Honestly, man, I I'm just so excited because like John said, you can you can catch Honestly, anything, man. It's it's incredible. This this pond is a dream come true. Honestly, I mean, this is. Fantastic. Think you're gonna catch another big one, Jake? I'm hoping to do it on the exact same pole. Okay. So, uh, what? You've already won. He found some scissors. All right. Something small. That way, I can see what's in here, what's biting, get my confidence up, and then start hitting the big stuff. So let's cast up on these banks before we walk up on them. See what happens. Here we go. Oh yeah, see if we get something right here. Oh, that's a big gar. I don't know if you guys saw that, but right over there. The gar are active. We're gonna go gar fishing tonight. We're bass fishing right here, lure fishing. Then we're gonna go gar fishing. We caught some, some little fish earlier for it. So I'm gonna see if I can catch one this time going through it again. They bit it, it just didn't take it. This is a good little area, let's see. Oh yeah, got one right there feels good too oh yeah that feels good it's fighting hard oh that's a good one look at that oh that is a big sunfish huh look that is a big sunfish yeah yeah sometimes I do that it just depends I don't even know, but they're, it's a, they're real active right now. You might want to get the big bait out. Oh, got one. Oh, there it is. Oh, God, this thing fought. That thing fought so hard. Yeah, they're, they're strong. Good God. That might have been a rock bass, too. That's like Right there. John, that's a rock bass. That's a rock bass. God, that's a cool looking fish. Look at that rock bass. Look how beautiful it is. Green little blue in it he hit it perfect right there on the on the edge look at that it's a cool looking fish look at this one look at that yep rock bass that's cool this dude literally has a chunk taken out the back of him right there I mean that's a full-blown chunk from the gar. No, what you got? Oh, oh. dude, that's a nice Hopper looking nose. fish. That's cool. God, dude, he got hit too. Not one of these has not been hit. Look at that on his, on his bottom. God, he hit hard. These things are aggressive. I dropped. I... Oh, got one. Oh, that one. That's a rock bass. Rock bass, that one. Oh. Tom pulled it right out. He ate it slow. I mean, Barely this, hooked. This is the normal size, and they're like the same size as bluegills, but sometimes they get really big, so that's why people hate them. Because they eat the same as bass. They got the same little things in the mouth, too. Mm -hmm. I, think, I think that these and green fish are basically the same species. They're just different, like, styles, like sunfish and bluegills. I think that this is the same, like, kind of bass as, like, a green, as a green fish. Their mouths are a little bigger. Oh, I got something. Oh, that's exactly oh, what I That's a rock bass. Yeah, he was fine. Dude. Heck yeah. He swallowed he it. He just got off the line. They don't like my colors much. He hit it a couple times and you were right next to it. Oh. He bit yours. Oh, that's oh, fighting so hard. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Which one's? Yours is bigger. Yeah. It's a perch, though. It's a bluegill. That's freaking sick. These things are aggressive. 
Ooh, See, it's always nice to come in here. Their mouths are different. It's always nice to come in here. God, it's a f these these perch in here are big fat perch. That's the difference between a perch and a, and a green fish. Oh, it's on. Holy! Oh, crap. You want to talk about a crappie, son? That's a crappie. Son. Oh my God! Good. God. That's a crappie, boy. You want to talk about eating? <laughs> That's what you should be eating right there. That's the candy of the pond. Look at that, dude. You're eating a crappie. They're sweet as sweet. It's a good one. It's a great. You want to eat some stuff? This one. <laughs> Tell you right now by Jordan's lack of excitement as far as food goes, he's never eaten one of these. <laughs> it's awesome though. Do you want to eat them? <laughs> no. If I want to keep catching those if they're in here. Dude, yeah, they're in here. They're and in the river, I'll they, get them. And, and they're in uh they're in schools. So we're gonna cast back. Start casting out. Let's get some crappies. Oh dude, if you caught 10 or 12 of these. <laughs> Got it on? Yeah. Did a green fish eat that crawl? It did. That's a big green wait, 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 that's a is that a rock bass? That's a rock bass. That is a it ate that crawl, dude. I can't. Look at that. That's why people don't like them, dude. They just ate a cool. You want to keep it? Dude, if you want to eat them, then yeah, they're, they're not necessarily great for the park. Guys, I think we're going to keep these rockfish to see what they taste like. Oh, he just picked it up. There was one on the bank. Just picked up my rockfish. Can't believe he ate that crawl. Oh. That's hey, a, look at his body. That's a, small one. that's the smallest one they're mating. That's the smallest one I've been caught. Oh, I've got, him. got him. Oh, we're hooked up now, John. Six pull on a track on a real pole. Oh, that's a green, that's a perch, those sunfish. Those things Oh, so that's hard. a monster one. They fight so hard. Are we keeping this? Yeah. Go put it in the bucket. Dude, these things fight so hard. Look at that. Is it an eater, John? Okay. <laughs> I don't really want to eat these, though. These will have little babies, and that's what the bass will thrive off of. So these are great to have. Those can spawn, and these are great to have in the pond. But the green fish, all the green fish you catch. Okay, guys, I just decided we, we want to eat a little bit of these fish. Normally we don't take them from here, but if we catch these rock bass or these crappie, we're gonna we're gonna have a little feast tonight. We could have already had our feast tonight. I know. We caught the five rock bass and the big crappie. And John, guys, comment if he's wrong, because I don't know if it's bad to take them out if they're these rock bass. He says they're nuisance and people hate them. Because they eat the same exact food as bass. But so if you're trying to grow big bass, and this is kind of our this is our pond we grow fish in. Like we throw them in and catch them like we are now we go to the river and get the other fish in the creeks and so i'm that's cool why people, oh that's why people like bluegill they don't eat the same thing as bass they can't their mouths aren't, aren't big enough. so they're food for the bass without taking food from the bass that's tasting got him oh, oh this fish, buddy. I saw that. no there was one we're gonna get enough of these to have a little dinner see how they taste never had them get out Time to stop messing with the rock bass, see if we can get a good one. Crappie? That's a keeper? Oh, that's a nice one. John's on the crappie today. The maps, dude, that's the best bait on planet Earth. <laughs> There's a little school of them over there. I got hit as soon as I hit the water the first time. Uh -huh. The second time, I went right back to where I was. Really? Isn't that hole, that big trench out there? There's some kind of trench right about there. All the way down, it's like a deeper hole. They're crappie. I've never had them. I don't know if this is a keeper size. I don't normally eat these fish I catch out of these ponds, so tonight we are. You're gonna be happy. Yes. <laughs> it's not a big one. That's okay, that's not a good one. That's a good one. It's not huge, but how'd it work? Yes. Oh, dang it. Ah, shoot. Just a bluegill. We need one more crappie. Oh, guys, I bet you couldn't even see that. I was off my hat. Just needed one more crappie or rock bass. That is not going to do it. Oh, sun's piping down. We don't have much time left. Let's get something. Let's get something. Got another one. That feels like the same type of thing though. Oh yeah, it is. Same thing. He's, they fight hard, but I've been so catching them non-stop. I'm trying to get a crappie or a rock bass. They fight so hard. I stopped it, let it pop on top of the water, you can't annihilate it. 
they would fight so hard. <sighs> they fight way, hard, way harder than any fish you catch. <laughs> they shake their head straight down. They swim hard. Yeah. They pull drag. These are strong, aggressive fish. And these things get, this is the base size. They get double this size. Just so you know, they live in flounders. <laughs> Seriously, they get humongous. He just flew, did you hear him? He's flying his wings. Guys, we finally, that's enough to eat, right, Jacob? Hmm. Enough, enough. You ever had a rock bass? No, I haven't had a rock bass. Me neither. Oh my goodness, he is. They love the green grasshopper. Go work it slow on the top. Huh? I can't, I can't see. Jake, give him some light. He's got the headlamp. He's got it. It's freaking, is it off? No. God dang, you must be good. That tiny hook, it must have went into the freaking throat. I got a net right here. Grab it hard, John. <laughs> That's a good looking one too, dude. It's a good size spotted car. We can eat it. Oh. That's a trap. Yeah, a little bait trap. Got all of it. Dude, that's sick. That wasn't very long at all, guys. The guard gonna be hitting tonight. Yeah, because you click the button. Look at that gar. John went in the water and got him. Had to. I'm hungry. <laughs> There's number one of the night right now. That's good eating, right, John? Yeah, that's good meat. We'll get plenty of meat out of that. Their poles are out here too. There's Kylie and John being idiots. We started a fire. I mean, it doesn't get much better than this. We already got a gar hookup probably. John's on one. I'm caught onto the line though. Here, hold that, Kylie. Hold that. It's a good size one. I can't see. It's a good size one. Yeah, but I can't see it, John. Okay, okay. Here, take this. Yeah. It's a little bigger than the other one, I think. We're ready for the ultimate Vanover Brother argument. Okay, well, no, Say famous ones, time. don't click off the screen. Stay tuned. Okay, let, let don't. I can't see it. Alright. He's still got some light. Get me to the top of the water, John. I'm not trying to mess with you down there. There. Oh, he just. Oh. He almost got me. Sweet Jesus. Jordan, you're holding the line tight. You just broke the line. Why are you doing that? I, you're holding the line tight. There's no drag can let him out anything. You literally just lost why, that fish for us. Why was... I don't understand why... You, you have one hand... All right, dude. All right, all right. I'm going to Jake. See ya. Dude, Jordan. John, you, why is there no drag on it? Because because your hand is holding the line. Ah. So any drag I can get, you're, it's going in your All right, hand. dude. That's frustrating, dude. Sorry. Is what it is? Why'd you grab it like that? Okay, my bad. Coming, Jake. John says I snapped the line, it's my fault. He didn't lose it, it was me. Oh, let it drag, let it drag, let it drag. Yeah, yeah, I got you. I got one. He's up screaming he right now because Oops, he's got an even it. bigger gar on the hook. At this point, okay, we did not one. have a net out. That's um, the one. bank is super, super steep, so you have to get in the water with it. And I didn't realize until you're about to see that the skin is super Special tough and they're super slimy and Keep hard to get a hold of. Plus, down they down have here. razor sharp teeth oh inside the water and it was pitch dark. He's big. Oh. He split, Jake. Has my oh god. Sorry, bud. Oh. Okay. You guys can't see this, but he's on a catfish, maybe. Yeah, it's probably a catfish. John's on a catfish. Jacob just caught a catfish. I'll go and get it. I got a minute twenty-six left of recording on here. There's that bad boy right there. Jake just caught this catfish. Yeah, I mean, Add I think the... he's a channel, but he might. Okay, blue. John hooked up with a massive fish. It was caught on a, obviously on a tree. It took some expert, <laughs> expert. He's been attacked. Oh yeah, dude, they love bullheads. Oh yeah, that's definitely a bullhead. Yeah, that's a bullhead. Oh, we need some fat, fat. I mean, they're not good for the pond, so let's, we can. That's yeah, yeah. Fat. God, that almost just came out of Jacob's hand, guys. He's on. Good hook set on this bad boy. Oh, 
Oh, the drag was on. Okay. Okay. Oh. He's on. All right, I gotta stop recording for a sec. To... And there it is. Jacob helped me land him. What is that, Jacob? Yeah. What is it? You're witnessing now uh, is the famous Jacob glitch. It's the catfish expert, guys. This is Jake <laughs> Jay Henny Catfish Nation, son. I'm ripping my hand. Jeez. Uh, Hi, guys. Had to stop recording to land it because. I had to get in the water down there with the net and get it. I'll look at it. Beautiful looking spotted gar. I think he swallowed it. Okay, so what's gonna stop us tonight is not we're not we're getting bites non-stop catching fish, but we only have that much bait left. That's it. But it's been a great day of fishing, a great day of adventuring, and I've got two baits left out here right now. See, that's our, la our last chance to catch something awesome. Let's see what we get. Okay, I've got the micro rod right here. It's being bent. Right now, I got a big fish head on there, like a big, big fish head on there. So it's gotta be a, a bigger gar or catfish trying to mess with it right now. But watch the line. It's just gonna take it from here and it'll stretch it back out. There it goes, there it goes. See, now it's getting tight, now it's getting tight. In case that's a gar, I let the line out because I don't want him to know the fish is on there until he swallows it. His mouth is too hard for me to set the hook and stay, so I gotta let him. There it goes again. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, guys. I freaking ruined that one because I pulled it too fast and it pulled it right out of its mouth before I had a chance to swallow the bait. So, lost that one. Lesson learned. You never know when the right time is for guard. You gotta feel it. Either let them run for 10 to 15 minutes and it's too long, or you set it too quick and it pops out of their mouth. So it's a game you play, you gotta live with. Jake is finally on one. It's been maybe 45 minutes. Yeah, probably. I've had I've lost like three or four. Hopefully Jake lands this one. There you go. Get out of his mouth. Yeah. It's hard man. I do that like five times. Dang it. You guys just saw on camera what I've been doing off camera for like the last 45 minutes. Oh, well, we took the head off. Okay, guys, this is what's happening to me like four or five times. It is screaming drag out of there. Okay, every time I set it, it rips it out of the gar's mouth. So it's really hard to be able to tell when to set the hook because he's pulling drag out right now. But if you rip it too quick, it'll pop right out of their mouth. They gotta swallow it. I can only record for a split second. This is pretty crazy. This line, this pole right here is being hit. And this pole right here is now dragging across being hit. There it goes, it's being hit. Okay, a little update. GoPro doesn't record this dark, so I have to use my phone and I can't record while I'm fishing. I hooked up, caught one. One's still on my line right now, pulling. Jake, in the meantime, just caught one. And I had to go help him land that one. So now I'm about to pull this one. It's been there for 15 minutes, the other one. So now I'm about to pull this one because it's tight been tight for a while if i pull out of his mouth i don't care at this point look at there jake just dropped his big old boy i mean he's aggressive too so we were about to land three possible gar in less than five minutes with all the poles going off at once all right update for you so reeled it in it was stuck on one of these trees out here like literally stuck pulled it out that's how strong this line is this power braid pulled it out broke a branch off with it pulled them in big fish probably 15 16 pound gar something like that Got him right up here to the bank, like super close with the net. And you could tell the fish was just in his mouth and he still hadn't swallowed it. So he just spit it right out as soon as he got to the bank and swam off slowly. It was a wild ride though, man. I got it back out. We're going for another one. Okay, for reference, I've caught one of these about the same size. I just pulled this one up. I caught one about the same size earlier. Jake says we can't get much meat on him. So oh, I'm back. you bastard. That hurt. <laughs> he got you, Jake. Oh, no, he got me. Uh-oh, uh-oh. This pole's getting oh, smacked. This guy actually bit it. 
freaking got my other line caught in his mouth. Now Jacob's over here doing surgery. Um, where's my where's my knife? We landed another one. There he is. Let's take a look at the teeth. And look at those bad boys. That's why you don't mess with them. Right there. Oh, he swallowed that. Yeah, we'll cut it. Jake, how was your day slash night? Dude, fantastic. We caught so many fish. We caught a lot of bait fish at the beginning. He came out here, caught a lot of small uh, rock bass, and then just a plethora of gar, spotted gar, alligator gar, incredible. A little, um, a little mud cat right there. But what a what an incredible time! This pond is always fantastic. No matter what. Well, that does it for the adventure, guys. It is 2 a.m. We are signing out. Always find a way to get outside, do something awesome, make an adventure out of nothing. Sometimes we catch nothing, but yet we still have an awesome time. We caught something tonight, though, and it was great and it was worth it. Sorry we didn't get any of the catches on there. My GoPro does not work at night. We will work on a solution. But for now, guys, keep staying after it and keep the adventure. Amen. <laughs>